I'm a little annoyed right now. I'm just going to leave this here. I've got some of these red meteor gems. I have no idea what the hell they do. I've got a crap load of meteor chips. Apparently there's something that could make a meteor detector or a meteor deflector or some shit. I'm going to have to look into that because I kind of don't See, Meteor Shield. Protected Land Tester. What the hell does that do? Okay, Meteor Chip, Redstone Cobble, makes a Meteor Shield. Meteor Timer, Freserite Crystal, what the fuck is that? Meteor Timer, Meteor Proximity Detector, I do not want a Meteor Summoner. That is the last thing I want. Okay, now what does a red meteor gem do? A block of red meteor gem. Meteor crash detector. Meteor summoner. Unknown meteor summoner. Okay. Help. I'm going to make a new gate. Since my last one got blown up by a meteor. Apparently I'm going to have to put meteor shields on the roof of the house to keep it from getting bashed in by meteors. Oh. It's kind of nice to have all the, the crap just go right into my inventory like that though all the time. <coughs> Sell some wood to the village. Oops. Oh shit. I broke my axe. It's okay. Plant some more trees. depressing. Yeah, not that it looked that great to begin with, but shit. Okay, I'm gonna go to the village, and I will see you in a bit. Bye. Well, good news. I went to the village. I sold them some more wood. I've been upgraded from a stranger to a known face. So, hey. They know who I am, sort of. They don't trust me, but they know who I am. That's nice. Okay, got a book. Add diamonds. Get obsidian. And enchantment table. Okay. I'm just gonna, no shits. Um, I make copper. Mm, no, not on me. Alright, I'm just gonna make another chest for right now. I'll turn that into a double chest. Actually, in light of this whole meteor situation, I don't think I want anything valuable up top. At least not till I get meteor shields up. Okay, there is nothing here I can't... I'll take the plant balls. All right, let's head back down to our mine slash meteor bunker. And let's just go down here a bit. I can't believe a fucking meteor fell on my mine. Hmm. I wonder if a meteorite pick can get that stuff. Still didn't find out what the yellow stuff was. Okay, here we go. Put my money in there. Put my meteor shit in there. Actually, I can get the meteor shit. I sold all my cobble. Damn it. 
these stairs in there. Put this crap in there. That in there, that in there. Plant balls. Okay. Mm, grab some cobble real quick. Hmm. I'll go this way. to make meteor shields. Because apparently that's a thing. There's some gold. I'll take that. And that, and that, and that. Ow! Do I have any torches on me? I have no torches. I have zero torches. Oh, son! Are you f Are you kidding me? God damn it. Okay, let's go upstairs and investigate BRB. Okay, well, I went creative and flew around a little bit, and I could not see any obvious signs of meteors. <sighs> so, I guess maybe this time it didn't wreck anything important. It didn't hit the village. That's nice. That sucks, though. So, I'm gonna go back down. See if I can finish, if I can remember what I was doing in the first place. Yeah, I'm getting to where I don't really see any upside to this meteor mod. I'll poke the wiki and see if maybe there's some trade-off. Because, I mean, the meteor equipment is nice and all. But it's not that good. Ah, oh, what the hell was I gonna make? I was gonna make meteor shields. <laughs> That's right. So I can get four of them probably. We're covered. Okay. Four meteor shields. Oh shit. <sighs> Get back in my inventory, for God's sake. Now, how does this work? Does it repel meteors? Does it... No, I think it's just you have to... I think you have to build with it. It's a block. That's an awful lot of shit. I will have to put them on the roof, then. You got any berries? No. Uh, I've got plenty of meteor crap. I just need some cobble. So I'm gonna go dig some more cobble out. Eek. Alright. That's where I got that obsidian from. Oh yeah, I need torches. Bad. Did I happen to get some coal? I did not, but I know where some is. Unless there's some more up here. I need buckets. I need iron. I'll get this iron. And that copper. Alright. Whee! Water slide! your shields. Oops. Hey, more redstone. No. There's some over there. I don't feel like going for it. I did get one on Ender Pearl. 
an Enderman decided to come up and check out my new house. He was not invited. So I sent him packing. Let's see. A little bit of coal this way, or a little bit of redstone. There's some quartz crystals. pickaxe. So I don't have to use up my diamond one. I better hang on to my diamond one in case of fucking meteors. Put this meteor crap away. Quartz dust. I think you can make a grindstone with that. Let's see. Oh, God's sake. Wait a minute. You can make heads? Okay, good to know. Gear, grindstone, okay. Obviously it has to be powered by something, though. Fluix dust? And that is what exactly? Conversion matrix. Oh, that's. There's some strange bullshit there. Okay. Okie dokie. Well, I'm going to go upstairs. And. Do do do. No, not this way. Actually, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to go up to about, come on, there we go, that redstone. Make some more meteor shields. Where am I, 28? I'm going to get up a little higher. Oops, me. About 40, and dig out another mine. Copper and stuff. And also get some more cobble. Oh, hey. Gold, copper, 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 iron. Ooh, nice. I can hop up on here. Okay. I'm just going to fill some of that in. Doop, doop. Okay. Carve that out. I swear to God, if one more meteor hits out here, I'm disabling this mod. Rage quit. No, I don't care. I do not want meteors destroying my shit all the time. That does not sound like fun. I do not want to build a nice house out there. and then have a fucking meteor come flying through the roof. I got my house plan all picked out. I have, uh, back in my Sims days, I used to go to Office Depot or Home Depot and get books of house plans to use for, um, planning out my houses for the Sims. And now that I'm playing Minecraft, I've dusted them off again, and that's why my houses tend to look like houses, because I actually use house plans. But anyway, 
My point is, I don't want to bust my ass building a pretty house and have meteors come flying through it. So. I do not want the meteor mod if it's going to wreck my house. That's all there is to it. But, if these meteor shields actually seem to work, maybe I will play along and make meteor shields and put them on the roof. And we'll, we'll see. We will see. Now I'm worried. I think this might be dark enough for stuff to spawn, and I don't have any torches. I've got some rubber up top. And now that I have gold, I probably do need to make a clock. But, I'll figure that out later. Let's head up here. And it's dark. And there are meteors. Rubber, I do. Cool. Okay, here's what I'm going to do is a little experiment. I have four meteor shields. I have some redstone. I did not bring my meteor crap with me. I'm going to dirt hut. Nope, not there. Four. Okay. Uh, no, not there. And if, God forbid, a meteor should come flying through here, shield charging. What's it charging with? Oh? What is this? Something's flying up into the sky there. Huh. What? Huh. stops meteors from hitting there. Okay, you know what? I'm going to take one with me. And I'm going to put it back down here. Go away, slime. Oops. I'm going to put it right there. Okay. <sighs> now, hopefully... This will keep my ship from getting wrecked by meteors. Get away from me. Alright. Well, we will just see if that works, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Hey, folks, and welcome to the last and final, hopefully, part of our <laughs> what's turning into our meteor special episode. Okay. Oh, God, I need to eat. Um, I did a little poking around on the Minecraft forum to the topic where this mod is introduced and figured out how the meteor shields work. Turns out you put them down, they do protect an area. Each one protects an area. And the more powerful they are, the bigger an area they protect. Well, you power them up you upgrade them by feeding them more meteor crap. And now how do you test the area that they're protecting? Well, that's easy too. You just 
That's what those um, protect land detector thingies are for. So, I think, is there some more meteor over here? No, I'm just going to go get some upstairs. Oops, not that way. There we go, this way. And while I was rearranging those t um, shields, I heard one hit. I do not know where it hit. Because I couldn't see it. And I couldn't see a crater. And I couldn't see fire. So, I'm going to just go ahead and put those in there, put those in there. Okay. Get ready to feed me some meteor deflectors. Actually, if that's how they do work, I need to take one down to the village. Hey, alright. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and take this one. I'll put a protected land tester down here. Okay, we're protected here. And here. And here. Wow. Here. Dang. Up, oh, not there. Okay. That is our range of protection there. Yep, I'm going to go ahead and take one to the village. But obviously, um, the place where I'm planning on building my house is safe. So hey, good news. Yep. Okay, and let's just park this one up here. This one, let's see, are we okay back here? Oh yeah. I'm just gonna go ahead and take this one then. And let's feed some meteor crap to these. Can you? Huh, I guess not. At any rate, where I'm going to build is safe, so that's all I really care about at this point. <laughs> Rain. I'm going to take this over to the village. So here, I brought you a present. kid. And we're going to park it. So the, the thing is, they have to be able to see the sky. Hey, how you doing? Getting resources for construction, taking resources for help. So I'm going to come up here. And I'm going to park this meteor shield right there. Park one in the middle of their rice paddy, but I don't know if they'd appreciate that. Here we go, we'll just put it over here. Is that protected now? No, it is not. Unless it just hasn't charged yet. Come on. 
Oh, it has to be able to see the sky, that's right. Uh, don't mind me, I'm just gonna... Turn the rain off real quick. There we go. Now, let's see if that charges it up. There it goes. That should be close enough. To get these things going. Alright. Come on, Meteor Shield. Do your thing. Oh, these do not drop when you break them. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> hey, all right. Let's see. Let's pop one down over here. Let's see how they're doing here. Yep, that's protected. And go feed a meteor chunk to that one over there and see what happens. That's protected. Good. Watch your tree farm. How's your tree farm? Tree farm is not, but that's okay. Let's just go feed your little meteor shield over here. Well, I guess that one is already fed. Let's see. Yep. Okay, well I'll just have to bring you another one for your uh, tree farm later. Yep, you're good. You're good. So, um, now that I brought you protection from meteors, why don't you, sell, why don't you uh, show me how to plant some rice? No? <sighs> I protected you from flaming death balls from the sky. The least you could do is show me how to stick rice in the ground, for God's sake. Konnichiwa, Cerebellum San. Okay, they're actually calling me by name now. Cerebellum San, excuse me. Okay, well that's nice. They like me. Let's see. Here. Buy some of my eggs. Okay. Well, anyway. I'll get you Ha Well, they're being friendly now. Alrighty, well... That's it for today, folks. Have a safe 4th of July. Watch out for meteors. Bye-bye.